So when these leaks come out and these scoopers put their watermark all over it, I'm going, okay, you were handed this by someone, paid to put it out there, and now it's all over the place. So that's why I'm like, all right, maybe I shouldn't show this, but I think it's, I think it's okay if I show it. Deadpool 3, Wolverine. We got a promo, a little promo that got apparently leaked, leaked, leaked. One of the scoopers leaked it. I do not think when they post something that it's an actual leak. I think it's handed to them and it's smart on Marvel Studios to actually do something like this. I think it's planned. Just like when it came to John Campia getting those images of the three Spider-Men in the final act of Spider-Man No Way Home with all the green screens and everything like that, and he put his watermark on it, which was weird, I think he, it was handed to him. It's just, Marvel's just using the internet, which is good. There's nothing wrong with that. I think other studios are finally realizing like, hey, you could utilize the internet to market your movie. Like, like, like I said, with the Dune popcorn bin. It's part of marketing, it's part of marketing. So when these leaks come out and these scoopers put their watermark all over it, I'm going, okay, you were handed this by someone paid to put it out there and now it's all over the place so that's why i'm like all right maybe i shouldn't show this but i think it's i think it's okay if i show it so we're getting that wolverine mask with the claws out and everything both of them posed right there looks really good i think that looks great that looks fantastic can't wait to see the actual image can't wait to see them together obviously we got the trailer that's coming out this weekend for super bowl so that's cool you can't tell me that that was not planned right there but what i wanted to actually ask and what I was thinking about today is that Wolverine mask. I mean, obviously it's got the white eyes, which is everybody's freaking out about that because there's always that discussion about the white eyes and masks. I mean, we keep on talking about it when it comes to Batman. Will it ever work with Batman? Maybe one of these days, maybe with Brave and the Bold, it will work. But what's interesting about that is when we saw all those set photos and we saw Hugh Jackman in the yellow suit, we never saw him with the mask. And then just looking at the mask and the fact that it's got the white eyes, are they gonna digitally put on the mask in some some cases? Is that what they is that what's gonna happen? Are they gonna actually? And I was kind of looking at some of those images today. I don't see any mocap dots on his face, but it just kind of made me go, are they gonna digitally put that thing? There's like a pose that he has on the beach where he's about to like f somebody up, but he doesn't have the mask on. And I'm like wondering, is the mask come later, or are they gonna digitally put on it? I hope they don't digitally put. The mask on but then again when it comes to deadpool's mask sometimes just to make the eye movements look really good they do have the mocap dots and a special mask for that so i don't know but maybe not there's probably obviously a full-on mask but i'm just wondering in certain instances instances that yes he will have like a digital kind of mask i don't know but 